Okay, how to beat Golden Wolf Lord. So, we're going to be using Geo Traveler for the majority of the fight here. Uh, this is ideal because we need a Geo unit for this fight. So, if you have another Geo unit and you don't really like Geo Traveler, go ahead and use them. Be my guest. As you can see, my gear is not fantastic, right? You don't need a whole lot of gear for this fight. Anyways, uh, here's my constellations. You don't need any of them, but go ahead. Uh, Amber here is just here for the double pyro bonus, which is a flat 25% bonus to attack, right? Shongling is also here for that purpose. And then, of course, we have Noelle, who is here for the double geo bonus, which is a flat 15% damage bonus while we have a shield. Anyways, let's get in the fight. Okay, so we have Golden Wolf Lord here. Um, this boss, if you don't know where it is, it's at the southernmost part of Tsurumi Island, right? You might have to do the entire Tsurumi Island quest for it, but don't worry about it. Just hug the edge in this fight and you'll be good to go. So anyways, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to hug the edge. Um, so these things, don't worry about them. You can dash pretty late, like right there, and you won't take any damage. So don't worry too much. Dash when you feel like you need to, and you'll, you'll do well. Anyways, pay attention to the direction that this head is facing in order to avoid the beam, and just hit it with a rock. That's the strat. We're just going to throw rocks at it. Uh, that's pretty much it. Also, um, that tail has a massive hitbox, so you can hit that too. Anyways, uh, so it has this tornado attack, right, where it'll just follow you around with the tornado, and all you need to do is just space out your dashes, don't panic, just nice and easy, one dash, two dash, and then once it goes to the center, ignore it for a little bit, it'll fly around, and then it'll be nice and vulnerable for you to hit. So let's go ahead and do a little bit of damage here, all right? You know, one, two, three. Oh, now it's back up. Okay, see, you can hit the tail. Big hitbox. Anyways, all we're going to do is we're going to hug the edge again, right, because he does some weird stuff. Okay, one, two. You can dash these real late. Three. Look how late I dash that. Nice and easy. Um, I don't think he's going to do one of the moves here because as long as you stay towards the edges, he'll pretty much just do the beam and that uh, skull oh, attack. Dude. So, he does have this dash, which all you need to do is just avoid it by dashing to the side, right? So don't worry too much about it. Anyways, he has this tail swipe if you're behind him. Just be careful, don't get too close. Don't stay too close to him for too long, right? Especially if you're a melee character, there's no reason for you to stay that close. Oh, okay, so here's barrier phase. So, he'll get this big old barrier and he'll spawn three different uh, little gray wolves, gray or black. Right? And all you need to do is hit them with Geo, right? One boulder and another Geo attack ought to do it, right? And it'll shoot, you know, homing bullets at you, but don't worry too much, right? And then, you know, take a little too long, it'll nuke the field, but as long as you stay on the side, you're good to go. No problem. Just stay on the edge and let it happen. Uh, it's really nice and pretty simple. Don't panic. Just sit here and smack the thing. And then it'll go into this really, really long vulnerability phase, where we can do a lot of damage to him. Um, and that's pretty much it. Yeah, we just sit here and we do damage, right? We get some good damage in while the vulnerability phase, and then we just rinse and repeat until he's done. He really doesn't have a lot of crazy bells and whistles. It's just, you know, avoid the barrier phase. Do as much damage as you can. Take your time. Don't panic and just, you know, have a fun time. Also, by the way, if you get caught in that little swirl thing once he gets up, he will do damage to you. Not too much, but he will hit you. Anyways, pay attention to where the head is. It went to the left, so it's shooting to the left. Anyways, we're going to wait for another rock because I don't want to bait the tail, right? Just stay on the edge, you know, stay decently far away. All right, it's going to the right, and so now we throw another rock. Anyways, easy. 